I, and see and just taking a look at Rob uh, just taking a look sounded to like see my Wiimote the, over there <laughs> uh, the rest of our um, the rest of our bracket uh, we do have to look forward to in winners semis uh, coming up we have John Numbers versus Helper and Tropical versus MGW oh but, are we just not going to have anybody oh no yeah we will have yeah. Wiimote production we'll, we got we'll that in here but in the meantime, we have our losers top eight match in Spider versus Heretta, Rob versus uh, Pokemon Trainer. As long as the Spider can keep up this combo game with Squirtle, it should be a good matchup against this Rob. Absolutely. I mean, oh, you always have to. Oh my gosh, but that possible early Ooh. kill? Nope. Barely surviving. Ooh, oh my a gosh. Perfectly timed, two perfectly timed Pokemon switches to uh, keep Spider alive, but now, uh, her or Spider rather, being stuck in Charizard. But. Really making it work with that back air, killing at like 76 after the hit. This is just an absolute slobber knocker of a first stock. Up tilt into up air, should not be doing it yet. Not yet. Pulling out That'll the speedy do it. rob. All right. Oh my gosh, even stocks already, not even a minute in. Folks, if you haven't been paying attention, now is the time. Yeah, this is definitely a set that you do not want to blink at as Spider continues these incredible Squirtle combos, utilizing the PS2 platforms, trying to set up for an edge guard here, just kind of swinging around these platforms. The Rob's got to be somewhere. Oh, not again! But instead, finding another arm row to confirm, and we're going to see it. All right, Heretta All right, still the not... Yeah, Spider oh! still able to make it back oh, and find no, another he reversal. he ran out of gas. Oh my gosh. Now Heretta just wasted a little bit too much looking for that uh, that spike off, or the arm rotor off stage, and instead it's going to be Spider. Oh my gosh! Just kidding. Heretta finding a dunk of his own, and we are back into even stocks. This is an explosive game one so far. All right, so, uh, you know we know we're in the end game of this game once we uh, we see the Charizard outs. Yep. Oh no. Oh, looking for wow. a uh, gyro confirm into the down air, but Spider fighting his way through the gyro first. Right, Spider back. knowing not to recover high against this Rob anymore. Yep. All right, back into this neutral. Reddit does have gyro in hand, but it gets deleted by the Squirtle back air. Now we might be seeing another uh, another edge guard, but Heretta going high doesn't want to deal with the Ivysaur uh, edge guarding as he had to do in stock two. All right. Ooh. Nope. Rob's a big boy. Not quite dead. Yep. We could see the Charizard come out very soon. Ivysaur definitely has ways to deal with high recoveries like Rob's. Oh my God! The the laser bounce. Oh, but catching Spider jumping out of the corner, and that is Heretta taking game one in an absolutely explosive game one. Heretta looking absolutely unfazed. Being like, all right, here's where we're going next. That f It felt like such a turn-based sort of game one of just like, oh, I'm going to destroy your stock, now you're going to destroy mine. But, I mean, those ledge interactions were so layered, and it felt like Spider was the one coming out on top most of the time, and then Heretta able to, you know, just finding find a reversal after the fact. Yeah, once Heretta stopped playing, like, roulette, it uh, really felt like a much more calculated edge guard. Yeah, one, once Heretta decided, you know, to start playing playing a more grounded game, a more um, more level-headed game, I guess. You know, yes. not looking for these like huge zero to deaths on uh, on Spider because I mean he got reversaled for it twice. Exactly. I mean, obviously it didn't even work out for the first stock. It started working out for like the second stock, but then never again. And oh my God, Spider just going for the early kills here too. Nope, not quite. All right. Late Nair setting Spider up here at the ledge, but a Razor Leaf from the corner now putting Heretta in a ledge trap scenario. Oh, unfortunately, just missed the timing through the arm rotor. Our head are playing very patiently here, throwing up the gyro a lot more. But Spider going for a lot more of a traditional Pokemon trainer game plan. Racking up damage with the Squirtle, going straight to Ivysaur for some mid damage. You possibly could see the change to Charizard here in just about 10%. We are going to see. I mean, Spider is definitely making this Ivysaur work right now, especially with the ledge trapping. 
have oh, oh no he's okay. gonna be making it back Yeesh. no the uh rob down air unfortunately spider just committing a little bit too hard there with the ivysaur you're gonna see that again nope and i mean this is kind of what we were saying before is Heretta, you know taking the time to just you know, just hang out and wait for Spider to make a mistake instead of trying to force the issue like super hard with like these huge zero to death confirms. Just playing this patient neutral, waiting for Spider to make a mistake. Oh it's yeah, paying when your dividends. When your opponent is hanging themselves, you don't stop them. You hand them more ropes. Just... Right. So Spider now with a two stock deficit. Really looking to swing and find Heretta's first stock. Forward air still not going to be doing it. I love that the water gun just pushes the gyro away. It's so funny. Unfortunately, no spike here. Heretta just doing a good job of making it back safely. Just air dodging into the ledge every time. Back air is finally going to take it. Yeah. But, I mean, at 197%, Heretta living to insane percentages. Meanwhile, Spider's last stock already starting to bleed a little bit at 53 percent oh my gosh what a mix-up all right the bouncing gyro catching uh ivysaur right, nice jab beating out the spot dodge red again a little too happy with that move oh no i love the idea there from reddit to try and cover the ledge with gyro just by like throwing it at the corner what Heretta has done to condition Spider to, per, to like to stop going off ledge with him has been incredible to watch. He's not going for the spikes anymore. He's just trying to get kills from the center stage. What, what? are you doing? Oh my All god, right. the taunts! That was the most scuffed <laughs> taunts to win that I've ever seen. You know what? I respect it because if we go back to that, <laughs> you, you saw the ice flash and he jumped out of fear that there was going to be a laser. All right, watch this. He goes back, taunt, immediately freaks out, I, and then goes back in. I read that as Heretta saying, like, I know exactly where you're going to tech roll, and then just whiffs the air. No. But oh. Rob back air is, is still a good move. So. It's, it's so good. It's so safe. K kind of a stuffed taunt, or scuffed taunt confirm. It's but not Heretta, scuffed if it works. Yeah, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll give you that. But Heretta moving us on into game three with a two-game uh, advantage. Uh-oh. It looks like we're going to be moving on to... Yeah. Yes, two. I'm playing Pikachu. Okay, sounds good. Oh, okay. we're, we're saying the seeing character seeing switch here. Swap. From Pokemon Trainer to uh, the single tried-and-true best character in Pokemon, Pikachu, canonically, I think. I mean, my personal favorite, anyway. I, I don't know about that. <laughs> Come on, Lucha Pikachu. Nope, oh, no, no. All right. Yep, Heretta sticking with the Rob, as we heard before. And we're moving on to PS2, a you know a pretty good Pikachu stage. You know, um, the uh, Thunder Jolt's going to be doing it so good at, um, you know, being able to catch Heretta out in that usual zoner position underneath the PS2 platforms, you know, fairly safely. And as well, of course, we got to deal with Rob against a, a combo character. Right. Honestly, I think this is a great pick for Spider. They've got the advantages with Squirtle with the combo game, but they have the weight of Ivysaur and the sur somewhat the survivability of Charizard, as long as uh, they're not hit too hard. Yeah, definitely a bit more of a uh, flexible recovery. God, the movement from Heretta with the, the burner boosts, the fast rob. Let's see. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, all right, we're seeing the lightweight of Pikachu. What a tech from Heretta. Can he make it Just back? He can. Quick attack, saving him. The oh. absolute confidence in Heretta's edge guard right there. Just like, yeah, I don't care if you're going to counterattack me. I'm, I'm completing this edge guard, and he did. We're not seeing a oh, lot of use of the Thunderbolt. Oh my gosh. Not finding the arm murder, just waiting a little bit too long though. Alright, the drag down. Tech. No. Oh. oh, but Spider ready for the tech that time. <gasps> and then Hans. The oh no! You're not even close to winning! That's dangerous! Oh my god, but it's working! I don't know. I mean like when you're when you're that far down and you're your, your opponent's taunting first, sometimes oh! you need the confidence. Taunt to get bodied. True combo all the time. 
you know, Don't do it again. The artificial confidence from a taunt can only get you so far. Oh no, the Conf uh, confidence is real. Whether you can act upon it is another ooh, story. Pareto. Oh, this is it, Spider. This is your opportunity. Your one chance. Make it count. Beretta is absolutely the one playing with confidence right now. Just going for these insane edge guards. And when you're like, when you're two games up, absolutely just go that for it. That might be game. No, barely living. What a good DI. All right, we got the spark jolt. All right, going for these. Oh, going for the nair loops. Yep, looking for some lightning loops, but only finding only finding a couple reps. Meanwhile, Spider's final potential finer sto final tournament stock is bleeding oh, no, really but bad. Scooped by the up smash. And yeah, Hereta with a just a dominant game three. Taking things over Spider, he's gonna be moving on into losers' quarters. No matter how tough those games got, Hereta never stopped smiling. Absolutely. The big scoop from Rob. <laughs> even, even from behind, that still scoops. Right? I mean that skull batch was really ingenious, using it twice, not burning the quick attack, finally making it back. That, I want to say uh. that sequence was absolutely incredible. The, te the tech on the Skull Bash from Heretta, keeping himself alive, and just catching Spider getting a little bit too aggressive with the reversal opportunity. Yes, unfortunately, Heretta having just enough gas in the tank to keep on keeping on. And just a little more to close it out there. Yep. Sportsmanship. Gotta absolutely. Love you, love to see, you love to see the competitors having a good time, but... In the meantime, we are going to be breaking to a caster swap as we move further on into uh, top six of Xenosaga. So guys, make sure you are staying tuned for some more hot sets, and we will see you soon.